6000 years ago a lush green tropical forest was slowly converted into one of the deadliest driest and hottest deserts in the world sahara desert in this podcast i'm going to present some new possibilities and geographical changes about the forest which was converted into a desert thousands of years ago the size of the sahara desert is huge with an area of 9.2 million square kilometers approximately 3 times the size of india and equivalent to the entire size of usa as far as our history is concerned 6000 years ago the vast sahara desert was initially a forest that received plenty of rainfall but shifts in weather patterns transformed the forest region into some of the driest lands on earth let's now discuss some new possible facts no doubt that if the sahara desert was still a forest it would be the world's largest rainforest surpassing the amazon rainforest but did you ever know that the presence of sahara desert is so crucial to the amazon rainforest but how the trade winds which blow over the sahara desert carries the sand particles along with it these particles are rich in phosphorus as it passes over the atlantic ocean they pick up the moisture as well this entire mixture gets deposited at the amazon rainforest which acts as a fertilizer and adds nutrient enrichment to the soil due to its phosphorus content this maintains the fertility of the soil so imagine that if the sahara desert was still a forest all of this couldn't have been possible the winds may get blocked as a result we may not observe the amazon rainforest to how it is today let's now move on towards the eastern part we all know that the sahara desert extends further east up to the western part of india if the sahara desert was a forest it would have extended in the same way as well coming to the middle east we know that this region is blessed with abundant resources of oil and natural gas if the region was a forest the excessive amount of moisture would result in heavy rainfall making it a very fertile land the conditions for the production of crude oil and natural gas are high temperature surfaces and dry atmospheric conditions thus the middle east may not be the leading producer of natural gas resources if the sahara desert was a forest let's move on to history now consider egypt the first thing which strikes you about egypt is its ancient and rich history the ancient egyptian civilization is one of the oldest civilizations on the planet dating back to 5500 bc where you might have heard about the mummies pharaohs and other amazing discoveries if the sahara desert was a forest all of this couldn't been possible maybe in a very different manner which we haven't thought about it so the ancient egyptian civilization could have been a huge twist there could be a lot of drama and lot of suspense for our final point we will talk about how this would impact the african lifestyle as far as we can assume agriculture will be the main occupation and source for livelihood as the lush green environment with an abundant amount of rainfall makes the soil fertile thus it becomes suitable for agriculture for various types of crops also the conditions make it suitable for coffee production since they lie in the subtropical region there are many factors which favor it like altitude weather and others and things like banana could also be the major source of income so that's all for today thank you for listening to our podcast this is shriram signing off for more updates do check out our channel podsquare cheers